no stopping us. Hey guys, what's up? Jeff here again to orient your fitness in the right direction. <sighs> Great coffee. So this video is going to be about stretching the chest muscles of your pec major and your pec minor. And I've done a video on this in the past, except I did not actually demonstrate the stretch of those two muscles in that video. And I will be doing this demonstration of the stretches for those muscles in this video. And you want to stretch the pec major and your pec minor muscles because these muscles, they can tend to get very tight on us, especially if you sit a lot and you round your shoulders, you do chest exercises in the gym, these muscles, they can get tight and then they can round your shoulders, put you into bad posture, make you have a greater chance of getting shoulder injuries. So it's a good idea how to stretch these, to know how to stretch these muscles. And for a quick, quick recap of what these muscles do, your pec major muscle, it's the large chest muscle most of you guys are familiar with. It covers your chest. It attaches to the top part of your humerus. And the main function of your pec major is to do shoulder horizontal adduction, essentially bringing your arm across your chest like this. So when I do the demonstration for the stretch, your arms will be raised 90-90 like this, so 90 degrees, elbow bent 90 degrees, go into the corner, lean in, and that will be stretching the pec major, and I will be de demonstrating that to you very shortly. And your pec minor muscle, it goes from your coracoid process on your shoulder blade, attaches to your third, fourth, and fifth ribs, and your pec minor muscle, it tilts your shoulder blade forward, and it also downwardly rotates it like this, so it moves it into this position like that. So we'll be doing the same thing to stretch the pec minor, except we'll be going higher up in the corner of the room to stretch it. Because when you raise your arm up over your head, the higher you go, you are upwardly rotating your shoulder blade more. So you are better targeting the pec minor, you're better targeting that muscle to stretch. So let me show you how to stretch these two muscles now. So now let me show you guys how to stretch your pec major muscle. So we're gonna go into the corner of the room, and I'm not gonna be exactly in the corner, but it's still okay, I'm still going to get an effective stretch. And we're gonna raise our arms 90-90 and lean into the wall. So it's gonna be like this, in the corner, raise our arms 90-90 and lean in. And we're gonna hold that stretch for a minute and do it two times, and that's your pec major. Now I'm gonna show you how to stretch your pec minor muscle. It's gonna be the same position as your pec major, except you're gonna go, higher up this time to better target that muscle. So we're gonna go into the corner, and we're gonna go higher up, and now we're gonna lean into the wall, and you're gonna do that for a minute, and you're gonna do it two times, and that will effectively stretch your pec minor. All right guys, hopefully you guys found this video useful on stretching your pec major and pec minor muscles. Hopefully this whole video helped you out. This has been Jeff once more, orienting your fitness in the right direction. If you liked the video, please thumb it up, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, I will see you guys later. I'll see you guys later.